Member for North Coast. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. Since their first introduction into the Canadian healthcare system in the 1960s, and more recently into the BC healthcare system as a regulated profession, nurse practici practitioners have played a vitally important role in providing cost effective health care to British Columbians. Their contributions are most deeply felt in our more rural and underserved communities, where their hard work and dedication to patients has helped ease some of the sting of the chronic doctor shortage we as a province are facing. Nurse practitioners are tightly regulated and must undertake additional training beyond their registered nursing degree. These men and women perform up to 80% of the activities of a family physician, including, but not limited to, diagnosis, treatment, ordering lab tests, prescribing medication, and admitting patients to hospital if necessary. Without their presence in the health care system, many more patients would be forced to resort to accessing health care through our hospital emergency rooms or simply have to go without. Nurse practitioners take a holistic approach, looking at the whole person, including a person's medical history, their mental health, and how their illness may impact their family members. The nurse practitioners Nurse practitioners are educators teaching about whole body health, healthy eating, and how to manage disease. Where I live in Prince Rupert, we have one nurse practitioner who is currently away on maternity leave. We wish Toby all the best as she embarks on the journey of raising her second child. Unfortunately and commonly in rural BC, recruiters were unable to temporarily fill her position while she's away. It's common to have these positions unfilled, even though we give lip service to their importance and need for more positions. It's a challenge we face here in British Columbia. With the current direction to increase access to primary care and decrease health cost pressures, nurse practitioners are an invaluable component to the health and well-being of British Columbians, and we thank them for their service. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. Thank you, Member.